from Manila in the Philippines. Today we are going to a restaurant, a very nice restaurant. So you can see I've uh, dressed up nice for it and we're going to have a unique experience at this restaurant. I won't tell you what it is actually, we will have to wait till we get there. It's going to be a very unique experience. I'm also joined with Sir Ali. So uh, yeah, while Harry is dressed up very, very nicely, unfortunately I am dressed like I'm going to be going gym. <laughs> I literally run out of every single clean clothing and my back smells like a fish. So uh, <laughs> there you go. Yeah, actually funnily enough, this is the only clean shirt I have. So I thought I'd whack it on. Yeah, we're going to get a taxi over there now and then we'll show you what this restaurant has to offer. Thank you boss man. Thank you. Thank you. driver uh, asking for uh, additional 50 pesos. So 50 pesos then meter. Yeah, no problem, no problem. Yeah, okay. Thank you so much for You're organizing. Welcome, sir. Okay. Hello boss, I'll, I'll go front. Okay. Thank you. Hello. Hello sir. Hello sir. Jerome. Jerome? Yes. Nice You're to meet you, Jerome. I am a blogger. Yeah. Where are you from? From the UK. UK. Oh. My uncle you? is also there. He's, he's, in, he's in the UK. Pastor. Pastor? Yeah. Oh, no way. Oh, that's awesome. Pastor, Pastor Jerome. No. <laughs> <laughs> we are just heading up to the Chinese bridge, the new Chinese bridge, which was apparently planned by the Chinese, built by the Japanese, used by the Filipinos and now vlogged by the English. Pesky English. And you see lots of people are chilling out here. Hello. 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 Hey my friend. <laughs> Where are you going? Hey, where are you from? Hello, England. Oh, right, everyone's just chilling here. What's up, Hello. Look at these, everyone's so friendly. We've got some street food. Ooh. Some dirty ice cream. Well, I've never, I've never seen like a, a just a standard bridge that people just chill, chill by. So it basically links Chinatown to the rest of the city. Um, Chinatown is where we've been staying, and we're heading to Pasai, which is where we're having dinner. We've got a trusty little Jollibee. We won't be having Jollibee here today, I'm afraid. It's the Intramuros. Intramuros. Yeah. We're in the old city. All right, guys, we have arrived. The restaurant looks incredible from the front. Uh, here, I have oh. 300. Oh. Is it okay? Thank you, sir. Okay, thank you. Be careful. Of course. Okay. Take care, okay. Thank you. Have a good evening, boss. This looks incredible. We got these. Uh... Ali, is that you? <laughs> <laughs> we got this uh, nice little. It's a huge sign, and then. This kind of gives it away what's going to happen, but we'll head in there. I, I honestly don't really know anything about this place apart from the, the name, which does give it away. It's called The Singing Cooks and Waiters. So let's head in there now. Hello, good evening. Randy, yes. how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Do you have space for two? Uh, but sir, uh, the 10, 10 o'clock is closed. It's 11 on Google. Uh, 11 if we... Friday, Saturday, Sunday, 11. Oh, can you, is there no chance you can fit us in? We are, we are vlogging. Okay, I asked my, my, my Thank my you, Randy. Supervisor. We are, you want a YouTube channel? Okay. Thank you, Randy. Uh, yes, yeah, yeah, you keep, you keep. Okay. Okay. Okay, good evening. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Jerick. Hello, good evening. Here? Hello. I think we're going here. Oh, where's where's Bess? How are you, Kurt? <laughs> I love that they have their name tag, it's so it's easier. Oh, they got a bottle of wine ready for us. <laughs> Sauvignon Blanc, my favorite. So, looking at the menu, we've got a whole bunch of dishes. We've got some seafood here, a little bit of Chinese food, and then, oh, the top hits here is well what is it oh we've got some pork and then beef chicken soup more pork i'm kind of the pork is kind of calling my name right now more. we'll go and ask what people we what people are having hello guys good evening what is the best thing to get here best, uh, best food. what what are you eating oh we're eating spicy. spicy 
Oh, spicy. Was it good? Yeah. Very good. Are you okay with anything like me? What do you like? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Anything. I'll eat anything. The best okay, thing. Maybe the beef, the spicy beef. Ah, yeah. 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 Spicy yeah. beef. Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Very nice people. The best thing to do is get a recommendation. Derek, are you, are you singing today? Yes, sir. You singing? Okay, awesome. I'll, we will all sing together. I'm terrible at singing though, just so that you know. Um, what is the best What is the best thing to get? The best, the best thing? Something? You eat pork, sir? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one is the best here, Chrissy Papa. Uh, that is invented by our owner. Really? Yeah. Okay. That's uh, the leg of the pork. Deep and fried crunchy pork, pork knuckles. Okay, okay. We'll get that one. We'll get the crispy pasta. That's me, that's me. Yeah. <laughs> this is the closer. Okay. It's, it's the same. If you guys didn't see, we are getting the pork. I don't know which one it is. One of these two. But it's the knuckles of the pork. <laughs> Wow, okay, we're, we're really going for it here. Okay, that's it. Uh, yeah guys, so they were, they were gonna close in like half an hour, so they have actually stopped serving. And you can see like the restaurant's starting to clear out, so I really appreciate it that they've, uh, they've stayed on later for us. Wow, you guys, you guys should work here. <laughs> I should work here, it's perfect, wow. Very good, very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Everyone's so happy here. Yeah.
Okay, okay, okay. At this point, I think they're doing all of this for us now, I think. Pour a little bit of oil in there. My cheeks are high. They should rename this place to the dopamine restaurant. Exactly. Now they're all going. So the, these guys used to work here, and these guys now work here. All right, guys. It's now 10 o'clock. So they should they should be finishing now, but they're still singing. So really appreciate it. We didn't ask him to do any of this, by the way. Although I, I say the energy could be better. <laughs> the company could be good. <laughs> I love this. I absolutely love it. Like if you go in with the right frame of the right frame of mind and you go match their energy, because their energy was great. Match their energy and you all enjoy it. But yeah, that was so so good. And we haven't even eaten food yet. And yeah, like I said, I'm not sure if you guys heard, but it's now 10 o'clock, so it's past their working hours, but they have uh, gone above and beyond. This is crispy pepper. Oh my oh god. My god. <laughs> it's a pork. It looks amazing. <laughs> it's crispy. Oh, look at that. Crispy outside, but inside it's... So this is the chef special? Yeah. Invention of the owner of this one. Ah, so okay. I hope next time if you will come back here, the best time to come here is 7 o'clock p.m. Okay. That's the best show, uh, 7 to 8 p.m. Ah, okay. And we are fully packed with... I appreciate, appreciate you staying open, thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah, these clay pots. Keeps it nice. This one is kare kare. Uh, beef. Beef kare kare in peanut sauce. Oh, nice. There we go. Uh, which one is this one? This is beef? That's beef also. Spicy beef, sir. Spicy beef. This one is... Your rice. Bagong sinain sa caldero. Very nice. Perfect. 
This is a feast. This is a lot of food. Amazing. Thank you very much, Arnold. Okay, All right, guys. So let's just go through what we got. We've got the pork. Um, this is the pork uh, knuckle, I think it is. And it's uh, the cook, the old cook's signature dish. Then we've got spicy beef over here with some peanuts on top. What was that again, sorry? Singing noodles. Singing noodles. I don't know what that is. <laughs> and then uh, chicken in like this. Uh, beef, beef. Oh, beef. Beef and peanut sauce. And this like peanut sauce and then just plain rice. So I've dished up a little bit ready and we'll just go for it. Me and Ali are doing a little bit of carrying sharing again. Um, but let's go for this. I'm gonna go for the pork first. This this skin looks incredible. Wow. Oh my god. That skin is incredible. It's like so so crunchy. So salty. It reminds me of pork uh, scratching, like pork cracking we used to have in the UK. That's incredible. And it's such a big amount. So we're probably gonna have to take some of this home. But I'm glad we kind of got a few different dishes because we can try it for all you guys. Um, like that. It's gonna be hard to beat that. Next we'll go for some of the, the noodles. This looks like it's cooked in some really nice like soy sauce. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks very much. Those uh, noodles are so nice. A little bit spicy, but very very nice. Thank you. Next we got the beef. Oh we got a doggo running around as well. This beef looks very, very tender. Comes off the knife so easily. And uh, some nice peanuts on it. Wow. That reminds me of beef stew where, that we have back home. It's cooked in this like really nice sauce. And then this, it was spicy, but it's, I'm not actually getting that much spice from it. A little bit of pepper, aromatic spice. But the best thing about it is it's so, so tender. Comes off the knife so quickly. And then finally, the chicken. That doesn't look like chicken. I think this is a bit of veg. We'll try it with the peanut sauce. It's beef, it's beef. Oh, but even so, the bit that I got was some kind of vegetable, wow. I think. But that peanut sauce, oh my God. I gotta try some of that peanut sauce. It's so like each little individual dish has its own little best bit. For this, it's the peanut sauce. Oh, that is incredible. I'd probably say favorite, it's gotta be the pork. Then the beef, the noodles. I couldn't really get much from the noodles, just like a nice little dish. And then the peanut soup, uh, peanut soup, peanut sauce, also a nice little addition. And then we just got some plain rice. Such a good meal, guys. I'm gonna struggle to finish it, but we're gonna do our bloody best and probably take some of it home. All right, guys. <laughs> the food is starting to uh, take over me. I'm feeling a little bit full now, but I'm gonna keep going. Oh, I've got indigestion from eating too quick. <laughs> My dad's gonna be gonna say, you need to stop eating so quick. Um, but I have to say, the best thing about this is this um, pork skin. Look at how much fat is on there. <laughs> I mean, to be fair guys, this is my first actual proper meal of the day. I've been eating like little snacks and stuff throughout the day because we've been having like a little bit of street food. So this is a proper meal. So I'm, I'm packing in the fat here, but honestly, I'm usually not that keen for like fat, like on a steak or on chicken, but this fat here is so, so juicy, so succulent with the skin. It's like so crispy. Wow. Incredible meal. How's that for you, bro? I'm starting to get the meat sweats. It's not because it's spicy, it's because it's a lot of meat. I finished half of this rice, but look at this. Completely demolished this Darn. one. This was so delicious, super succulent. I know I'm gonna get this probably tomorrow, but right now I am happy as a pig. <laughs> Me and Ali keep, we've gone into a cycle of eating very late and um, having really big meals late. So I'm not too sure what the effects of that on our body, but we skipped breakfast, even though we, we have breakfast at our hotel, we skip breakfast every day. We have my little street food snacks and then a huge meal at dinner. Probably not the best way to live, and I w wouldn't recommend this usually, but it's just how it's working out at the moment. Oh, that was incredible. Yeah. How, how many years have you been open and working? 
uh, we just opened last April. Oh. But before, but before, sir, we started 1991. 1991. Yeah, the owner, a moved to uh, province. He made uh, a bigger restaurant, uh -huh. uh, which is uh, called Kista. It's a floating restaurant wow. with lots of cottage, fish. Wow. And um, how, you know the, the songs that they do, how many songs do they sing a day? Uh, we have at least six, five to six shows a day. Five to six shows? Yes, we have um, three in lunch and in the evening we have three also. Oh, okay. I really appreciate you staying open for a little bit longer. Yeah. It was very kind. No way. Oh, thank you so much. This is cool. Cool. to run with sorbetes. You're amazing. Banana? Yeah, that's banana. And it's ube? That's ube ice cream and vanilla. Oh my god, that's so kind. You, uh, you dip in the ice cream and cherry. Okay. Thank you very much. Look at this, guys. We have even got a complimentary dessert. So it's a uh, fried banana, vanilla, ube, chocolate sauce, and some cherry. I mean, we both said we were full, but you know, there's always space for there's dessert. Always, I think there's a little space right there, a little <laughs> sliver. Just for some sure. <laughs> yeah, just a heart attack right there. <laughs> All right, guys, and here we go. We have some churon with a little bit of ube, a little bit. Of We'll just dip ski in the chocolate ski, in the ube ski, oh my God. vanilla ski. Look at this. I actually have had your own before in the Philippines. It was a few, it was my first impressions video. You guys have seen it. We'll go for it. Mm. Oh my God. Deep fried. Oh my God. That's one of the best desserts I've ever had. Woo! Gotta have a little bit more. That ube, one of my favorite flavors from now on. A bit more, just like a mixture of crunchy, banana, cake mixture, chocolate, and sugar. <laughs> Don't wow. forget the cherry as well, my bro. Oh yeah. We need to share everything, huh? the meal and the cherry. Ooh. Get a punch of that cherry flavor. Wow, that is good. Okay. I do like the uh, the ube. It's my favorite. I'm gonna finish it off. Wow. I was going in for seconds. But this is good. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good. I've literally had so much noodles, so much beef, so much chicken, uh, so much rice. But believe me, there's always space. You get off one. <laughs> hey, easy, my guy. Easy. <laughs> this is so much like food. Honestly, I should, I should stop eating. I should really stop eating. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you're making a real mess here. I feel like I'm slowly going into a food coma. Right <laughs> I'm gonna sleep well tonight, guys. I'm gonna sleep very well. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. Okay, one more. <laughs> okay, I'm done. No, I'm done. I'm done. All right, guys, and the final bill comes to 2,566 pesos, which is just under fifty dollars. So again, not cheap. But we did have probably a meal for four people, so I guess you could split that in four. Um, and we got complimentary dessert. We got a private show. We got incredible staff. Great food. Can't I can't complain, guys. And yeah, really good meal. Just a real shame, there is one real, real negative, and it's the company. <laughs> if anyone like wants to come traveling with me, please let me know, because honestly, like, the sooner I get rid of it, the quicker. No. Easy, my guy, easy, my guy. <laughs> Only joking. How do you say it? Mabuhai. Mabuhai. Thank, Mabuhai with me. Thank you very much. Nice to meet you guys. Long live. Long live. Long live. Thank you so much. Mabuhai, Mabuhai. Philippines. Thank you very much. Thank nice so to meet you. Nice to meet you, sir. Thank you, brother. Oh, we'll, we'll take that. Thank you, brother. Nice to meet you. Thank you. This is uh, this is our food for the next five years. All right, guys. As you saw, had an absolutely incredible meal. I keep saying this, but every experience I'm having so far has been the highlight of my trip. Like, I'm absolutely loving my time here. The people are so so friendly, and I'm falling in love with this place. 
Remember guys, I'm making videos every day at 7 p.m. local time, Filipino time. So make sure you check it out. Subscribe, like, comment, and let me know where I should go in the Philippines. Um, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in tomorrow's video.